Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Today I have got a food haul for you. Um, as you can see by the background, we're not at home. We're still in Poland. It is a very misty day. The apartment we have is right on the river. Um, so it's very misty today. But yeah, uh, we went to a Piot and Pavel, same supermarket we went to on our first trip here, um, but a, same brand, different store. Uh, this was an inner city one, so it was much smaller. Um, to be honest, didn't like it um, as much as the other one, but it's five minutes up the road rather than 25 minutes up the road. But the one that's more rural is much bigger and had a lot more selection, but we still got quite a bit of stuff. This came to uh, 231 Zolotti, which is a bit like 33 no, 43 quid, just over 40 quid, um, yeah, again, could have done it cheaper if bought more local brands, some of it is local, some of it is international brands, so you pay more for those, but it's what we did, um, yeah, I'll show you what we got. Okay, so we'll start over here, we got some mints, beef mints, and we got some sliced white bread saw this i don't think i've ever seen this before this is a snickers um peanut butter i don't think i've seen these but there's like it says four but they're like that's a portion you can feel it in the packet but it's like it's four portions in this and they're 130 calories per portion so yeah uh but it's good um We've got a bag of mushrooms, some mozzarella, we got a red pepper, a deep pan, ham and mushroom pizza. We'd rather have a thin crust but they only had deep pan pizzas there. Um, the smallest red onions you've ever did see. I've got a couple of different packs of porridge just because it is so chilly. Like um, it was I think zero this morning when we went out but with a feel of minus five sometimes you need porridge in your life so I've got two sachets of porridge oats with strawberry I've got some white rice to have one night this week bin bags um, we are obviously in an apartment and I think it's kind of catered for people that are staying a weekend because it was like two bin bags but we're here for a little over a fortnight so definitely needed some this is what I'm saying about buying international brands. We could have got, so this is a um, sweet and sour sauce. Could have got a, a local brand for a lot cheaper. Same as the shop we're in today, they had a lot of Jamie Oliver branded sauces. Um, but sometimes I'm a bit funny with cooked pineapple and I know I like this, so I've got that. And then we've got a bolognese sauce. And we've got some Actimel for healthy tummies. So yeah, we've got eight of those. Lou roll. We've got a garlic bread. And then one of these extra long. Like this is for a lunch. It's like an open pizza. It's ham and cheese. And then this is another lunch. I think it's pumpkin soup. I think that's pumpkin. Um, oh, that's my bottle of water from earlier. John loves jerky, so he got three types. Oh no, yeah. So classic, smoked, and original. I don't know quite know what the difference between original. You'd imagine original and classic would be the same, but yeah, John picked him up some jerky snacks, Irish cheese, salted crisps. Pack of Earl Grey. This time, if you watched last week's video, we've got the wrong flavour. I like the cherry and um, the raspberry flavour, but the this one's my favourite. So these are the fruit flavoured Jaffa cakes. Yum. Dishwasher tablets. Again, our apartment didn't really come with enough for what we need, so we just bought up another pack. It wasn't expensive at all. Then, I got, as I said, these are the other porridge oats I got. These are just natural. There's no flavouring, no fruit in there. I thought I could 
add my own stuff to that one. I've got a blueberry yogurt because I fancied it, and then some strawberry yogurts. Um, oh, frozen peas, <laughs> so British. Um, and then some these pierogies, but if you look, they're baby tiny ones, they're really cute. Um, so we've got meat pierogi and a rusky, which is potato. Um, so yeah, they look good. And then some ham. Um, we didn't buy any drinks with this food shop just because um, we had a, a bit of a hike from the shop to the car park because it was an inner city one. So we'll probably have to pick some up later on. Hi guys, so I've just been shopping. We've actually been to two supermarkets today. We went to a rather disappointing <laughs> Tesco's um, and then we went to a, a Piet and Pavel, Pavel and Piet, Peter and Paul. Um, yeah, some of this stuff is not edible as you can see, um, but yeah, just picked up some bits and bobs really. Okay, there we go. So in each store um so tesco's we spent 116 zloty and in pit and pavel we spent 103 um and 100 is 20 quid basically so it gives you a good idea so i've got two rather large bags like we all know i have giant hands two bags of pick mix they are to take back to work um, because that's what you do when you've been on holiday. You take sweets back to your friends. Um, we got a lasagna. I'm loving pasta at the moment. Um, kind of sweet corn. These, oh, we need to hurry up because these are not, these are ice creams. They're like, I think there is a strawberry, a cherry, a black currant, and John wasn't sure what that one was, but he said he'd try it. So yeah, they're quite fun. And then we seem to get these every time we go grocery shopping. The King Bars, they're yum. Um, this is actually what we went to Piot and Pavel for, and we did pick up a couple of extra bits. But um, if you've followed this for a while, you will know that I have a big one of these at home. So these are funeral candles or cemetery candles basically pretty much everybody has these at their loved ones graves um a lot of the time you have them at like special statues and um outside churches and there's always ones outside the war museum it's just something that you do here i have one at home john's mum um who is as, as is John, she's Polish heritage, and she asked us to get one for her, and we've also got one for um, John's godmother, um, and I think, so basically we got one for, one for me, they're quite beautiful with the crosses on, one for me, um, two for John's mum, uh, and one for John's godmother, so basically these will go on his Baptist grave and his godmother's mum's grave. Um, so yes, and then we got a load of the special candles um, that goes in them. These last like two days. So yeah, they're beautiful. And I have a multi, they didn't have the multi-packs. Um, these were like 40p each. So we got all of them. <laughs> um, but I've got multi-packs at home that fit my ones. So I thought I would have these. So these are just battery operated ones. And then my mo John's mum can have my multi-packs as well. Because I don't burn mine that often because um, I have it on a shelf rather than a candle appropriate space so I thought I could put the battery operated ones in and then it can be used on the shelf I've rambled too long about candles um, this is John's favorite toothpaste we buy this at home but at home it's like three pound three pound fifty and it's like just under two quid here so bargain cucumber I really fancy a tuna sandwich so tuna John has got a little bit of a cold and he is snoring so um, we picked up some of this nasal spray to hopefully help that because John isn't uh, he doesn't snore all the time it's normally if he's had a beer or uh, he's ill so hopefully that will help we've got some Oshi John got the orange one I really like the blue one and um, in the shop we were today they had the zero sugar version which you just can't you can't always get 
these the like places like home bargains sell oshi quite regularly but you can never or i very rarely find the zero one in the uk so i'm very happy with that we got some garlic olive oil we got three steaks even though there's two of us um but yeah it was like three for three quid and they are rather beautiful so there we go and then we got two bottles Coke Zero, one of my favourite chocolate bars of all time, is the Milka Peanut Caramel. It's just divine. Um, bag of sprouts, big red onion, giant. How? At first, when I saw this, I thought it was horseradish because it was so big, but it is a parsnip. Just crazy. Like, that is a big bottle of Coke, and it is the same size. Fab. And then um, in here, there is a beetroot, uh, four carrots, a bag of salad, and a bag of grapes. And that is what we picked up today. Hey guys, so we just nipped to Zabka, which is a corner shop, um, to pick up a couple of bits. We spent... 16 Zalotti, 69 Grosch. Give you an idea on cost, 15 is three quid, so. Cheap. Only got a couple of bits, but I'll show you what we got. There we go. Um, we needed milk. I really fancy a boiled egg, so we got six eggs. In my opinion, Zabka have the best apples. I was not impressed by the Tesco ones when we went there recently, but I really like the Zabka apples, so I got two of those. And these are slightly addictive. My favourite one is the cola one, but they didn't have any. So I got watermelon and rainbow flavour. But yeah, they're just like sugar. And that's what we got.